Hello, can you believe the TV series Doctor at Sea was released 49 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now, who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Jeffrey Davies was born on December 15, 1938, in Leeds, West Riding of Yorkshire, England. He played the character Dr. Dick Stewart Clark in the TV series when he was 36 years old in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 2023, he passed away at 84, leaving us deeply saddened. <laughs> Second hand, of course. Oh, dear chap, you must be joking. They are 120 pounds each. Do you have any secondhand ones? <laughs> um, it doesn't hurt, but it can be a little bit, too, you know. Mm, I can imagine. Yeah. Anyway, once you've located it, mm. the vein, that is, mm. it's really quite simple. You just... Robin Edwell was born on September 27, 1946, in Birmingham, West Midlands, England. He played the character Dr. Duncan Waring in the TV series when he was 28 in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 1999, he passed away at 52, leaving us deeply saddened. Job back while it's still open. Huh. You're no good as a surgeon without me. What? <laughs> you, you, shove off. If he doesn't, then you must tell him. If you don't, you could be breaking the law. Because every employee has the responsibility to take reasonable care for his own safety. Elizabeth Council was born on June 7, 1942, in Windsor, Berkshire, England. She played the character Nurse Joyce Winton in the TV series when she was 32 in 1974. She's currently living happily at 81. <laughs> oh, oh yes, 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 fine. Mm -hmm. uh... In here are basic medicines, cough mixtures, aspirins, mild analgesics, and so on. What's upset you, dear? Perverts. The bloody lot of them. I've seen some things in here today that would curl your hair, Celia. John Grieve was born on June 14, 1924, in Maryhill, Glasgow, Scotland. He played the character Purser in the TV series when he was 50 years old in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 2003, he passed away at 78, leaving us deeply saddened. What? You are a purser. I know that. Ah, uh, can you tell us how we get to the captain's cabin from here, please? Captain's cabin, certainly. Go through that door there and go after... Concentrate and put one foot in front of the other. Uh, at this rate, we'll be lucky if we get there for breakfast. Ah, well, suits me. I'd sooner play first to... Patricia Hamilton was born on April 27, 1937, in Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. She played the character Cecilia Tranmere in the TV series when she was 37 in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 2023, she passed away at 86, leaving us deeply saddened. Look here, Cecilia. Well, no, I won't call you Cecilia. Now look, I am your doctor, and I'm not allowed to... I'm not allowed even to kiss you. Don't worry, I'll do the kiss. Now look, please, this is very simple. No. And I was nervous enough about having this part and doing it for the first day, working with Kevin as a director for the first time. And Sandra Dickinson was born on October 20th, 1948, in Washington, D.C., USA. She played the character Nurse in the TV series when she was 26 in 1974. She is currently living happily at 75. <laughs> Purser, just do it. Oh, so you're the doctor? Yep. My mother's the old cow. It's <laughs> poignant uh, time in her life. Um, her first marriage has gone down, she's remarried, and her career is a bit bumpy, mm. really. Bob Todd was born on December 15, 1921, in Favorsham, Kent, England. He played the character Sarah in the TV series when he was 53 in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 1992, he passed away at 70, leaving us deeply saddened. A carpet, an egg, and a bit of crumpet. I couldn't care less. Well, <laughs> you can beat an egg, you can beat the carpet, but you And Bob, the pals you work with weren't the only ones in on our secret because, of course, they've also been keeping it at your home in Burwash, Sussex, and from there. Harry Tobe was born on July 27, 1925, in Lund, Antrim, Northern Ireland. He played the character Charlie in the TV series when he was 49 years old in 1974. 
We regret to inform you that in 2009, he passed away at 83, leaving us deeply saddened. Captain's table for tomorrow night. <laughs> Look, you can't buy seats for the captain's table. You've got to be invited. Stuart Clark can fix it with the head waiter, so you get... Ernest Clark was born on February 12, 1912, in Maida Vale, London, England. He played the character Captain Norman Loftus in the TV series when he was 62 in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 1994, he passed away at 82, leaving us deeply saddened. ...shared by the entire medical profession. You're hot-headed, insubordinate, and you've given me a headache which has now lasted approximately 10 years. <laughs> and also... Graham Armitage was born on April 24, 1936, in Blackpool, Lancashire, England. He played the character Sharp Assistant in the TV series when she was 38 in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 1999, he passed away at 62, leaving us deeply saddened. £25. <laughs> I'll be with you in one moment, Captain. <laughs> Richard Bryce was born on January 30th, 1942, in Birmingham, UK. She played the character Polly Roberts in the TV series when she was 32 in 1974. She is currently living happily at 81. And I do feel the doctor should be allowed to talk to me. I'm afraid I can't allow it. Ship's discipline must be maintained. What will my readers think of a ship where the captain did... Christopher Mitchell was born on May 21st, 1948 in Surrey, England. He played the character Doctor in the TV series when he was 26 years old in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 2001, he passed away at 52, leaving us deeply saddened. David Prowse was born on July 1st, 1935, in Bristol, England. He played the character Nobby in the TV series when he was 39 years old in 1974. We regret to inform you that in 2020, he passed away at 85, leaving us deeply saddened. I mean, I, 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 I had a, I think I, my, my top weight that I put above my head was about 350 pounds. Well, I mean, these, uh, one of these actors probably weighs let me know who's your favorite character in the TV series Doctor at Sea and share your thoughts on the deceased actors by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.